the guy that we see, the sort of fun-loving guy that we see, or that they'll see on screen here in high society, and many of you want, obviously have seen the film at some point, but the fun-loving guy that we see there, that, that was your dad to you, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he has, you know, he's got some other reputations. I don't know whether you know of him. Uh, um, <laughs> but to you, it's this guy, yeah? He, well, it's both. I mean, I knew of both ways. But um, he was more of a, of a fun-loving, humorous, silly father than people might anticipate. You know, he wasn't always there. I mean, there was down down periods without him, and that's what was so, I think, so important about the humor in him, because he would fill us up, and he would be huge in a room, or huge in a car, and just big at a dinner table, and then, of course, in broken homes, that, that energy goes away, mother or father, and it was, he was, he was, he was big, he was bigger than life, but quiet, and funny, and normal. 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 Yeah, that was normal. So, these are the chairs I have ever sat on. I think it's going to fall down. So, that would be horrendous in the present. So, then you mentioned that he got along well with Charles Walters, which prompts the question that I had anticipated asking, who did he not get along with? <laughs> I don't think he got on well with Bob Aldrich at all. If he is the man who directed, uh, uh, was it Four for Texas? I'm going to test you again. Aren't well, I? I think you're going to have to say the name of the movie before I can jump in there. But that one, that one, I had heard that was not a good shoot, and I was old enough to know what that meant. So then, they didn't get along. And what about, uh, was there anything that you know at the time or know now about uh, about your dad's relationship with uh, Ray Crosby? Obviously, you know, these are two they of them. They were very close. And these were two of the, I guess, singing stars in the world yeah. in, in, in 1956. Yeah, dad you know? really, he, he wanted to be big. He, he tried to emulate big. And, and Bing, very sweetly, not too long into dad's uh, uh, solo career, said, I was working my butt off and the little pop under the porch was at my heels, you know, he, he knew that this was going to be a, a power to contend with in his business. And he supported that all the time. When I rewatched the movies 